E. That's for the benefit of anyone watching this replay. <laughs> All right. Let's allow some people to get in here, shall we? Which is actually quite convenient, because it allows me a few seconds to set up the stream as well. Alright, that's better. Good day, Alex Dunn. Who the hell are you, my friend? Alright. That is fine. Alright, I think we're ready to go now. Woo! Maladin B says, let's go, drinker. Or should I say, let's go. So, you know what? I've got Final Fantasy VII Rebirth all installed and ready to go, but I don't know, man. I was kind of enjoying just doing these chilled little Tomb Raider streams, and people seem to be liking it too. So I thought, why not do a little bit more before I transition over to Final Fantasy VII? Because I know once I start playing that, I'll never really look back. So this might be my last chance. Me and Lara, it's our last chance to have some time together. All right, let's shoot some lions. Shoot some helpless animals, that'll fix things. Damn! That is one resilient lion. Kinda looks like it's dead. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so for anyone who doesn't... hasn't been keeping up with these streams, we're on level 5, which is the Colosseum. And we've just fought Pierre Dupont. So, my memories of this level are pretty hazy but I'm going to try and just actually navigate it by thinking and using my brain instead. Which is a novel concept, I know. Ah, Heine Hole says, Drinker, why not play Helldivers? Why not indeed? I just haven't had the chance yet, you know? Yeah, that'll be a door then. I was wondering if that was a, a block that I had to push, but apparently not. Right, what have we got up here? Anything interesting? I know they put a short on Lara's boobs. It's not ideal, but that's what we have to work with these days. Oh, another door. Okay. Probably, I think I'm going to have to go down onto the Colosseum floor then if I'm going to get any of these open, because there's some pits there and stuff that I have to... Is this a thing that I can push? No, it's not. Okay. Open bar later? Yes, it is. I am going to be doing an open bar tonight. We have got Gary Mauer's recovered now. We've got Robert Meyer Burnett, and we've got Little Platoon coming on. We're going to be talking a bit about Dune 2 and various other shenanigans. Oh, no. <laughs> Guess you can't make that one then. Let's see what we got down here. Ah, you mad lad carrier. Playing it on graphics mode. <laughs> Oh, PS1 graphics. There you go. Yeah. It's for the true discerning gentleman. Uh, what was wrong with Longman? I ah, just, uh, he had a bit of a migraine last time we were going to do open bar, so he wasn't able to make it. But he was there for last orders, so that's all good. And he's feeling fine now, so. Okay. We're not going to be able to get through there. We'll have to find a switch to open this up. Let's see what we got down here. Oh crap. This could be the kind of place where things go wrong. Events R1 says, how am I liking it? I'm liking it a great deal. Oh shit. Apart from all these frickin' lions that I've got to fight. Yeah, that's what you get. Alright. So we got a couple of switches in here. Alright. Have you tried Hell Divers 2 yet? I have not, sadly. But people are saying lots of good things about it. Is it like Starship Troopers? Is that basically what it is? If so, sign me up. Right, that's one gate open. Next one. Can I open both at the same time? Should be able to. Oh, 
man. Meyer Kicks says he got uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, played it for a little bit, and then he's been playing Tomb Raider Remastered since then. The old games have still got it, man. That is uh, that's worrying. I'm hoping that it lives up to expectations. I really am. Because uh, I'm one of those crazy people that enjoyed the part one. I like the final. Oh, shit. That's a lot of lions. Damn. Time to do some creative jumping. This is where I really wish I had the Magnums. Yeah, Valiant Renegade. He's going to be buried in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth this weekend. It's a pretty good thing to be buried in. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Dropping kids off at school, then I'm going to play Rebirth. I like your style. Oh, where do you come from? Yeah, like I was saying to people earlier, I feel like once I get started on Rebirth, I'm just not going to look back. And so I wanted to give this just a little bit more of my time. I honestly would have loved to have completed this before Rebirth came out. I uh, just didn't quite have enough time. We'll see how far we get today, you know? Actually, before I go any further there, let's just save that. Anyone down here? Not much going on here. We just need to look for something. Is that a pressure plate? No. Just a slightly different block. Oh well. Right, so the doors are open. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Oh, is it a pressure plate? Must be. No. Oh, it is. Right, okay. So, I've got a stand on this one, maybe? Right. Oh, damn. So, you have to be quick. Okay, fine. We can do that. There. Ah, okay, right. I sort of get what they're wanting me to do here. So, I just need to be nice and speedy with this. Yeah, okay, fine. Oh, drunk Lara there. Okay. So I've opened something, but what is it? What's my recommended alcoholic drinks? All of them. Open that. Oh, is it like right? <laughs> I see. It's a timed one. If only there was a sprint button. No, oh, what am I missing? Left. Okay, let's go left. Ah, right. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Okay, fine. Stand on the pressure plate. Open up. The one here, and then, yeah, there's no t no sprint button in Tomb Raider 1. So I've got to get in here, flick the switch, then get into the next place next door. Okay. Got to speed it up. Go, Lara, go, Lara, go. Come on, come on, come on. Oof. All right, good. Yes, what Solomon saying, it likes cl uh, classic Jack and Coke. That's what I tend to drink when I'm on live streams. Yeah, especially open bar, or at least some kind of bourbon and Coke. You know, it just goes down nice. What we got down here? Spikes. <laughs> Definitely not where you want to end up.
When am I going to be playing Nude Raider, they're asking. I need to find out if there's some kind of patch for that. I'm sure some genius has invented it already. We can do it. We have the technology. Ah, I can't get the right camera angle here. Where's up? Where's the best way to go? All right, I think it's this way. That's better. All right. Now that we're here, let's save that. Just in case I fuck up a jump and fall. That calls for a celebration drink. Okay, that's better. Alright, just need to figure out... Where's the best way to jump? It's got to be from here, surely. Anything interesting over there? Not particularly. Yeah, I'm going to have to do a run and jump for this one. I think she can make that. That's more like it. Go on, girl! Let's see if there's anything interesting up there. Feels like the sort of area where they might have an item. Clark's saying, uh, it's funny how the textures are high res, but the gameplay is still blocky. And, uh, well, yeah, it's still block based. They, I think, captured the perfect combination. Definite graphical improvements, obviously, from a texture point of view, and it certainly runs a lot smoother. But, uh, you know, Tomb Raider wouldn't be Tomb Raider without block based puzzles, I suppose. Hmm. Well, you didn't get much out of that. I like this little area. Look at that. You've got little, you know, she's lounges to sit on. Very fancy. Oh, interesting. I hear something, but I can't see it. Yeah, Blarbful says there's no yellow paint. <laughs> Every item's covered in yellow paint. Of course it is. All right, block. All right, guess I've got to pull the block out. Uh, Cody's saying, have you played the Silent Hill games? I have indeed, yeah. Been a long, long time, though. All uh, right. Uh-huh. Why doesn't she do that? Uh-huh. Whoa. Camera spazzed out there for a second. Alright, where was that door? Hmm. It's not there. It's not down there. It's back down in the Coliseum level. We got there. Water. I don't believe I've got a key for this yet. Nope, just got the ski on. Okay. Alright. Yar, me hearties! Where am I going here? Yeah, I'm just not entirely sure where that door is that's opened. Must be over this way somewhere, I guess. Maybe up near the Coliseum entrance. Oh no! Ah! Okay, fine. We're down. Try over here.
Is that it over there? Oh yeah, there we go. Mr. Kike says, Hydrant Curry, you handsome devil. <laughs> wow. You're pretty handsome yourself. Alright. I want to definitely save this because there's a feckin' boulder there, and that usually means bad stuff's about to happen. Uh, right, so if I just run... There we go. No! Oh, no, no, don't jump up! No! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that! <laughs> I knew what I was supposed to do there. Um, Alright, well, lucky that I saved it. Yeah, I think I just touched the, the up button, up, like, kind of by accident. Hey, that's better. Let it roll over your fingers, it'll be fine. Oh, is Az streaming at the same time, is he? He's probably playing Final Fantasy. That absolute devil! Alright. I like this, this... There's a lot of backtracking in this level back to your central area, but uh, it doesn't feel gratuitous or unnecessary, so yeah. We need to get over to the other side, where the other door was. Oh, hi. Where ya? Oh, there's Pierre there. Dick that he is. I'm gonna get you, you cheese-eating surrender monkey. Come here, biatch. <laughs> yeah. It's great because I can just aggro him from here. Um, the game just needs to allow him to get out of sight so that he can disappear. I know people are saying leave him, but it's like, I can't resist. Just shooting him a bit more. <laughs> Dick. Oh, here we go. What have we here? No, shooting the puzzle is probably not going to solve it. Is it literally just jumping? Huh. To just climb up and flick the switch? I mean, sure, I guess. Got a feeling the game's gonna pull a little stunt on me though. Maybe it's timed. I mean, that's the issue. Is that movable somehow? Nah, it can't be. Just a weird texture. Let's see what it would have looked like in original mode. Ah! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> uh, okay, cool. Yeah, there's uh, there's Lara. Oh, there is something on the other side of that, actually. Wait a second. What are you hiding from me here? Curious. Curiouser and curiouser. Hmm, okay. I need to come back to that one. I wonder if that's on a timer is... Huh. Let's see where this takes me. I wonder if the other door is on a timer of some sort and I had to, like, speedrun that. Right. 
water. Very nice. And that's us out the level, I guess. Where does that take me? Let's have a little investigation. Uh, is it possible to just, you know, just push this out? Okay, where are we? What's this place? Uh... I presume there's a door there of some sort. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, hello. Key that I need. Danger Man Repairs says, what is your favourite Tomb Raider drinker? I think it might actually be the first one. I feel like they just got the formula perfect. Second one I quite like. The third one, uh, I didn't find the puzzles all that intuitive. You know, sometimes like when you eventually solve one or you have to resort to a guide or whatever, you look at the solution and you're like, how the fuck was I supposed to figure that out? It just doesn't make any sense. So, yeah, it's sometimes it does resort to that, which is a little bit annoying. Um... Hello, Mr. Monkey. But yeah, they certainly had uh, gotten the mechanics pretty slick by that point. Uh, I wonder if I have to go all the way round now again. Let's go then, let's find out. Ain't got no time for you. Someone's asking as well, what did I think of Legend? So I, I think that trilogy of Tomb Raider games, for the most part, was pretty good. Um, I didn't love the controls. I always find them quite heavy compared to this, which I know, like, Lara's essentially just floating on this, but it just fit perfectly with the, the sort of fast, high-jumping nature of the game. Uh, whereas I think, like, Anniversary and Legend and Underworld, they just felt a little bit heavy somehow. Um they were pretty fun games so no major complaints they'll probably get a remaster at some point Tomb Raider Underworld had lovely bot physics <laughs> should have a little look to see what's in here then I guess before we move on I could really do with new guns like the magnums or something People getting excited to watch Dune too. Hope you enjoy it. I did. I love the the fact as well that my review of it got age restricted for no fucking reason. It's like, oh, there's <laughs> they're swearing in it. Yeah, no kidding. Like that's like every one of my reviews. Don't know why it suddenly became a problem, but whatever. Oh, hello, Mr. Crocodile. Let's uh let's just shimmy on past you. Don't mind me. No. Oh. Where's the switch? Am I missing a switch? Oh shit. Nah! Did I swim past it? Might have to go up and get some air first. Is it right at the beginning? Is that why I missed it? some oxygen before I do anything else. Ah! I can shoot it if it comes up. Hmm. Oh, I can.
All right, let's try that again. And let's try not to die this time. Uh, right. Keep your eyes peeled, gentlemen. Is there a switch near? Oh, yeah, I see it. Fuck. Yeah, there we go. Alright, up, Lara, up. Okay, good. Gonna do the trick. Ah! <sighs> I'm not the only one that can bleed, huh? You might say, if it bleeds, I can kill it. All right, forward. Wait, is this back the way I came? Yeah, it's back the way I came. What is that weird texture that they put there? It's like a curtain or something, like a stage curtain. Alright, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh, right. <laughs> what? This is the way out? What was in that other door then? All right, fair enough. There must have been some kind of secret in there, I suppose. Yeah, everyone's like, that was the end? Like, that's not the way I remember it, but, oh well, whatever. We'll never know what was in that door. Unless I go back. Nice place. Right, I should save it here. There we go. Alright. Let's see we're going here. Hey, the critical doggo's come to join me. Hello. How's it going? Uh, someone sent a super chat as well. Um, Billy Vigar says, Hail Drinker, when are you going to have Star Wars Theory on the open bar? It's got to happen. It will, indeed. Yeah, um, I'm planning to have him on when we actually have Star Wars content to cover. Um, there's not really any new shows yet, but I guess when The Acolyte comes out, I can have him on. Let's see what we got here. What a lovely area. Yeah, not gonna let me shoot them, eh? Alright. Let's see what this looked like originally. Uh, not so great. Were they sprites? No, no, the pillars were at least 3D. To look out there. No. 
can't see. So we're in Palace Midas now. Look at that. I know it's just a simple thing, but just a little bit of dynamic light in there makes all the difference. Especially compared to what we had originally. All right, go, Lara. Swan dive. Sorry, I'm doing this for Harambe. Onwards and upwards. The swan dive is gorgeous. Let's do another one. And yeah, I could have dived into the pool, but I didn't want to. <laughs> oh, more. Damn, they really love these monkeys, don't they? They can kind of mess you up as well. I need that. Okay. What do we have in this lovely area? A sundial? Not much to be done with that. Maybe I can get up here. Nope. Did I go too fast? Flew too close to the sun. Ah, oh, too far. And up. Oh. That's better. Mysterious music. <laughs> I remember this place. If you've played Tomb Raider before, you know what this is all about. Shall we do it? <laughs> yep, should we do it? Oh, go on then. Let's give Lara a heart of gold. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I love the noise. Clunk! Okay, so we don't want to go on the hand. Hmm, I think we have to bring something here. We have to bring something to this room, as I recall. It's like a key or something. And turn it gold. I don't think there's anything here yet that I can use. Let's have another look around outside. Alright, so that's still locked. So we can't go that way yet. Are you a weird, angry-looking head? Oh, a switch. There we go. Which one did it open? That one. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Oh, damn. <laughs> uh, right. <laughs> Clearly did not see that one coming. Well, at least we know where we're going. Oh, come on, get down there. 
Really? You're just not gonna go, huh? Yeah, man, Lara got fucked up there. Doesn't look great. I have to time this right. Okay. Oh, okay, that didn't work. Try again. I think maybe I do I have to wait in the middle for a second? Yeah, okay, fine. Oh hello. Magnum Zay. Eh? I've been waiting for these. Now my life is complete. And we we'll take it. Which I definitely need after that shit. Is there a way to shut these things down? I mean, I guess I'm just gonna have to jump, aren't I? I can't run this. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to jump through it because obviously the floor is gone. Okay, that's fine. Well, at least now I've got some artillery. Right, now that I've done that little section, where to next? Let's see what's around here. So I've been through there before. What have we got? Giant crocodile. Fair enough. I kind of want to try the magnums on it, actually. Oh, that's the last place you want to be where there's a crocodile around. Oh, what a sound. Nice. Sometimes crocodiles, just like RKO's, come out of nowhere. Oh. Do I take the high road or the low road? Let's see what's down here. you got for me level. Yeah, this is a big place. Let's have a little look-see. Doesn't seem to be a whole lot of stuff here. Alright, plenty of ammo. Let's see what's along here. <laughs> yeah, I had an instinct there that something was going to be waiting for me. Feels like they're probably not worth my magnum ammo. Now I hear fire. 
So that's got to be a good sign, right? Where the hell's that coming from? Must be above me or something. Yeah, someone's mentioning, like, I wonder how the animals interact with each other in a place like this. Do the gorillas fight the lions? How do the crocodiles feel about this? Uh, how do we get up? That's the ultimate question. Ugh, fuck off. More? Really? I'm trying to, I'm trying to pan my camera around a little bit. Oh, right, okay. So there's a bit there. I don't think Lara can jump that. She'll just slide right off that platform. Okay, so this can't be it. Here? Nah. It's got to be over here. Oh, do I see a crack? I think I do. Just not sure how to get to it, that's the problem. Hmm. Oh, okay. Can we get up here? No. Alright, she can't go there. Okay, no, nah, this is too steep. She can't get up there. Let's get. A Let's go back a little bit and look. Okay, so there's definitely a crack there. I just don't know how to get to it. Right. I'll try going the other path then. Maybe that brings us out to the upper level. Thank you, David Barrowcliffe. Good advice. There's another one in here. There's a lot of doors in here, damn. Perfect. Bunch of dead gorillas, just how I like it. So we want to go over here, probably. I do hear fire. Oh my god, something's on fire! I don't get it. I feel like I should probably jump that. Run and jump? Let's give it a try. No, guess not. I can't jump that. Putting me to a lot of busy work, game. Well, that's okay. I don't mind. I 
feel like she probably would have glitched onto the top of that, but never mind. It's okay. Right, so that platform you can't reach because there's a railing. Lara's only true enemy. Uh, doesn't that tune just get you in the feels? Let me just answer a couple of super chats here. Uh, Ian so forth, gifted 10 critical drinker memberships. You lovely man, thank you. And bro, that's funny, he says, if today be about June 2, please put spoiler tags uh, on open bar. Yes, um, I'm going to try and keep it as spoiler free as I can. Um, because yeah, I know a lot of people haven't seen it yet, so I don't want to ruin it, but we'll try and keep it vague. It's down there. All right, let's... I feel like I can't open all of these at the same time, because that seems too logical for this game. Let's see what's down here. All right, so at least we open it from the bottom, which is nice, so we don't have to go through all that again. All right, find the door that opened, I suppose. That'll be the one. Since there'll be a test here. Ah, oh, yeah, that'll be the fire then. Hmm. Oh, right. So, do you just have to do this while being on fire? I mean, that's an interesting slant, I suppose. That giant rats. I take it there's not a switch where you can turn the fire off temporarily. So this just seems rather unfair. Let's see if there's anything down here that might help. Yeah, you can't honestly have to just... Yeah, surely you can't do the whole thing while on fire. Oh, I wonder if you cross that line. Uh okay. Let's try it. That's not going to work. Ah, oh, almost. Son of a bitch. Yeah, I think my positioning wasn't great there. But okay, fine. Probably should just reload it there. Would have been easier. Never mind. Okay. And go! Ah, shit. Let's load. Son of a bitch. If you yeah, okay, so if you stop even for a second, you lose your momentum and then you can't do it. So, okay. Annoying, but fair enough. Uh... <laughs> this could be where you get treated to me doing this like 500 times before I get it right. 
Yeah, okay. Oh, come on! I should have had that! How did I not get that? You must have to get that pixel perfect. Ah, oh, man. I definitely should have ca caught that. That's it. It's got to be. Okay. Sorry that took so long. Right, and I never want to see this room again. Yeah, I did the thing. Woo! Yeah, I think I will save. Don't want to go through that again. Okay. On to the next one. I wonder if they're all, they can't all be fire related, surely that would be a bit tedious. <laughs> right, next one. Ugh. Where are you at? Okay, the doors go one at a time, so... Was there one over here in the corner? Can't actually remember if, I remember if there was one here. Nah. Must be back here. Must have run past it. Oh, hi. Okay, where's this door then? Where are you at? Got that one, got that one, got that one. Hmm. Been in that one already. Will it be in another area? over here just in case okay oh wait a second yeah, I have to... Right, okay, I have to flick certain switches to get them open. Right. Alright, so... Check the other one that I did. First of all. So that was... One switch down and the rest up, so... Okay. That one looks weird. Let's try this one over here. Yeah. So I have to have the third one and the last one down, okay, for that.
Okay, you. Last one there. And then these have to go up. Should do the trick. Okay, what delights do we have in here? Huh, definitely want to save this. Spikes. Spiky things. Spikes are bad. Spikes can make you be not alive. So. I got a feeling got to jump down from above and then get this just right. Hmm, what's the block for? <coughs> Pull it out, maybe there's something interesting behind it. sound great. But oh well, we'll see what happens. Ah, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. So we definitely don't want to fall here. I don't know if it's timed or what, but Oh no. Yeah. That wasn't good. In fact, I would go so far as to say it was downright bad. Alright. <laughs> Don't want to do that again, basically. There we go. Okay, lead bar number two. Got. And the hard part is oh, can we get off here? Ah. Uh, no, we can't. I mean, really, we should just run off here and get the hell out of here. All right, there we go. Take a bit of a hit, but that's all right. Okay, that's that door taken care of. What's the next one? So, um, down and then, yeah, okay, fine. Up and down, up and down. Ah, dick. What am I doing? It's these tank controls. Normally I love them. <laughs> they do have some downsides. Okay. 
went the wrong way. Okay, next room. Before I do that, let me do these super chats here. Um, Mr. Bolticus says, ah, Palace Midas, you multi-lever trickster, you. Good luck, drinker, and Godspeed. Yeah, it's uh, it's quite a challenging level, this one. It's surprisingly huge as well. Uh, Emma Ellis says, have a drink on me. Really enjoy watching your videos. And that was for £20, so thank you very much, Emma. Appreciate it. And Tanaru says, oh my god, so many good memories are flooding back. Cheers to the drinker and keep Lara Croft sexy. Good advice for life, sir. All right, what does this place contain? What fresh hell is this? <sighs> That's better. What do we got? Well, we're in a room with stairs. Let's use the stairs to leave the room. Ooh, hello. Oh, right. Three bars? Okay. What's up here? <laughs> See the shotgun shells here, and you have to ask yourself. How did they end up here? And why? Okay, so I think this is the room where we have to exit from, if I'm not mistaken. So I get the bars, put them on the Midas hand, turn them into gold, and then insert them here. Okay, fine. So can't do anything else here until I get all three. So I need to get the final one from this other room over here, presumably. Let's see the code. Do I have to guess this one? So it's down. Oh, that's okay. Right, so I just have to guess it then, basically. Right, let's go. I mean, it can only be one of two possibilities, really, can it? So this is just busy work for me. Do it. Let's have a look. No. Okay, so let's try this. There. Okay. <laughs> you guys can't see this, but the critical doggo beside me, he's just decided to turn upside down. He's got a habit of doing that. It's great on live streams when he decides to show 10,000 people his junk. Absolute exhibitionist that he is. I'm going to save this. Yes, I'm abusing the save function. I don't care. Oh, no enemies. Okay. Makes a nice change. Hmm. <laughs> what did you glitch into? Through the tunnel. Down or up? <coughs> a block, okay. It's a nice, funkily colored block as well. That didn't sound like it did a whole lot of good. Is there anything behind this? <laughs> a switch, perhaps? No, nothing. 
I'd probably pull down that pillar that was above me then. Maybe? I guess? Let's see what's up. Yeah, if you pull a block out and you hear a massive crash coming from the room above you, it's always good news, I'm sure. Camera's spazzing out a little bit, a bit there, but that's okay. Uh, right then. Oh, okay. So the room's sort of filled with sand. Very blocky sand. Right. I think I can stand on this, but let's find out. Man, I actually can't make up my mind if right. <laughs> oh, no, I hear fire again because you know. We have so much fun with fire here. <laughs> hmm. Just a little bit of everything in this room. Make your way over here, monkey. There. Mm, crocodile as well? Fine, join the party. I don't mind. Everyone is welcome. Yeah, that's right. I just fucked you up, bro. Right. More crocodiles. Do they just keep spawning or what? Alright, let's see what's here. Looks like it's probably too high for her to climb out from. Years Rhoda asked me what am I playing on. It's a PS5. That is what I'm playing this game on. Damn. I am, I am impressed by how big this level is. Ah, fuck it. It's not that important that I get these. Uh, yeah, it's just magnum rounds. Fuck it, I can do without them. Okay, let's go back this way. Because clearly, we've got something we need to do in this room. Do I want to climb up here? Nah, I can't go that way. Just check along here, make sure there's nothing I need. There's definitely another monkey around, but I don't know where. Nah, so there's nothing here that's useful. 
All right, so that's a waste of time. Whatever I'm looking for must be over here. Mm, I wonder if I've got to slide. Like, jump over there, slide down, and then grab the ledge? Yeah, I'm going to save that for sure. Because I can see this going horribly wrong. But let's try it. So, yeah, it turns out that wasn't a great idea. <laughs> So, that doesn't work. I mean, I knew we couldn't get to that bit earlier, so I feel like there's got to be something useful here. Is it just you got to aim for the right bit? There's a bit that's slightly lower there, so maybe that's why. No. Nah. Okay, so that can't be done. Can I get down from here? No. Is there a bit further along that I need to go into? It might be, actually. It's not too far. It's not going to be pretty when I land, like, but... Okay, at least I know I can do that, I think. Okay. Yeah, I just have to go and try and fight them then. Son of a bitch. Okay. Fine, at least I know I can do it. Probably. Right. Let's go down. You've got a shotgun right there, actually. Well, let's try that. For the other one. Okay, so there's a med kit there, but I feel like there's got to be more in here than just that. I don't know where it came from, but fair enough. Do we have anything here that I need? Nope, nothing at this end. Medkit, I'll take you. Dixon Cider says the game's stingy as fuck with the shotgun rounds. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> there. 
Okay. Not entirely sure what I'm missing here, because that's just a first aid kit over there. Even if I get that, what's that accomplishing, really? <laughs> Slow and steady wins the race, Lara. Hidden passage. That presumably is where I want to go. Yeah, I was starting to think there, oh damn, I feel like I've wasted this position that I was in. And I don't know where I'm supposed to be. Hi, that's for sure. Okay, so the floor is going to collapse here. <laughs> but I do want that med pack. That is a long drop. Slightly pointless, but sure, okay. <laughs> now, where am I? I have no memory of this place. Huh. <laughs> Thought that drop was going to be a lot bigger than it actually was. Another feckin' crocodile. It's the last thing I need. Truly the last thing. Okay. Honestly, I'm going a long way for a lead bar. at the top of this place. There it is. My lovely lead bar. 
<laughs> so beautiful. And then we just have to get down. Yes! <laughs> that is the furthest I've ever gone for a good bar. Let's go hunting. Got three whole rounds. Whoa, okay, there's two of them. That's not good news at all. Can I jump to there? Brown's asking who's going to be on open bar tonight. We've got Nerdrotic, we've got Robert Meyer Burnett, and Little Platoon. So that is our lineup so far. Right. Presumably. Oh, no, done that bit. So, got to go to the Midas Hand, turn these lead bars into gold, because that's the thing you can totally do. And then put them in the machine. I like how the devs go a little bit easy on you here. You know, they give you a quick shortcut back to where you were because otherwise, damn, this would be quite a lengthy procedure. So hopefully it's down here. Am I remembering correctly? Is it here? No, it's not there. What am I doing? There we go, there's Midas. Okay. Kind of have to be careful not to fuck this up. <laughs> Don't want to turn Lara into gold again. So, if I'm not mistaken, you have to go up to it and then just hit use? Is there a better place to go to do this? Am I just not right, quite at the right angle? I can't get any closer than this. be from down here then surely get as close as you can Lara and then use them that way there we go okay that was a weird animation but uh, got to do it every time eh I mean imagine if I'd only done one and then I had to retrace my steps well, that would just be unfortunate. Okay. Shadow Faxes asking, are these Tomb Raider streams going to be posted to watch again? Yeah, of course they are. Um, I always put them on my second channel, so you can find them all there. Anyway, now that we've got that, we can go and turn them, or put them into the 
lock thing to get the hell out of here. I want to save just in case it all goes tits up. I feel like we have to fight Pierre here or near here because he's shown up quite a few times and it's about time we finished him off. Right. Final door, it's... Uh, bleh, which one is it? It's not that one, is it? Is it that one? No, we've done this one. Yeah. It's the one over... here, I think. Right. Down and down. We gotta open the switches again. That's it. Oh yeah, wrong one. Whoops. <laughs> Dick. Let's try that again. Totally meant to do that. It was just a test for you guys. Is it here that I have to fight him? Maybe not. Maybe it's the next area. Who am I to say? One bar. Two bars. bars. Woohoo! All right. I actually traveled five kilometers there. Oh, hi. Let's see if we can get a better view here. That's better. Well, while, while you guys are enjoying that, let me just answer a few of those super chats that came in. Um... Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, here we go. Mo Sislak says, morning from Los Angeles. Good morning to you, Mo. Hope you're having a great day, man. Uh, HR Geiger Search History, which I'm sure is extremely dodgy, says, hi, Drinker. I have one request for um, AOT. Review seasons 1 to 3 separate from 4. The best reason I can give without spoilers is 1 to 3 are June and 4 is Messiah. Ooh, okay. Um, Andrew Clark says, was there a British Museum trigger warning? I know, like, what can I say? We're... We're, uh, <laughs> the um, museums that we have here, you know, we're just saving these artifacts because it's not like they were well looked after. Uh, Game Statistics says, you've been a, a busy boy. Congratulations on getting a full film out there, man. One of these days I'll get a hold of you to check out Paula and Sora if I knew uh, how other than Switzer. Um, oh, yeah, Game Statistic. Um, yeah, you've got a good channel, man. I hope you're still churning out the content, but... Um, yeah, if you need to get in touch, just use the email address um, on my About section on my uh, on my channel. Uh, and Freeman says, good afternoon, drinker. Seeing part June Part 2 on Saturday. Very much looking forward to it. Awesome, man. I hope you enjoy it as much as I did. 
and JDA Productions says you Tyrone and Nerdrotic are a fourth on Hell Divers too. <laughs> We've definitely got to get Gary in playing that. <laughs> It'd be amazing. Uh, get away, you. Damn, that's a big rat. Uh, anyway, what I might do is finish up just now because it's been a lovely stream, but I kind of need to get um, my other stream set up for Open Bar later, so I better finish up there and get it sorted. But hope you guys have enjoyed this little fun adventure in the world of Tomb Raider, and I'll catch you on the next one. But for now, that's all I've got. So go away.